Hi guys, what is up and welcome back to my channel. I chopped off all my hair and I dyed it dark. It's not gonna stay this dark, but she had to go this dark for it to line up um, to the color that I do want it. But I'm so obsessed with the dark color on myself. I'm really happy. Um, I'm about to go get Josh. He's with some of our friends' dogs. We're um, dog sitting for them. So I'm here, I've been alone like the last like few nights by myself with Svenny. So me and him are about to go get Josh and we are going to go get lunch at Costa Vida and stuff. And then I have some Halloween stuff that I need to pick up from Target. Um, so yeah, I just, it's going to be a weekend in the life, but I'm starting it on a Friday just because we are doing some stuff today that I would like to get into the vlog. So yeah, and hopefully this week we can wrap up our Halloween decor. I'll show you guys my outfit because I'm actually super hyped about it. I'm wearing this skirt that I actually got from Nasty Gal this time last year. And then with my black docks, and then my sh the shirt is also from Nasty Gal. If they still have either of these items, I will happily link below. But if they don't, then I can try and find something similar. And then this necklace is from Princess Polly. And then this is my little J one from Etsy. Um, but yeah, I just thought it was super cute. Matches the dark hair vibe and the fall vibe. And then I also got this really cute hat from Dressed in Lala. And it's actually an olive and peak hat, but it's blue, and I'm trying to decide if I want to wear it or not, because I feel like it makes the outfit have, like, more of, like, an edgier vibe, which I'm really digging lately, but I can't decide. But I do want to get a cute picture in this outfit and with my new hair. I'm so happy. Welcome to the vlog. Okay, so I'm home now. We went to lunch with Josh and then we went to Target and picked up some of the stuff and actually ended up picking up a, a few extra things and I'm going to show you guys kind of my little Halloween gift that I got with Taylor. Also, I picked my face and I'm really regretting it. <laughs> but, oh, let's see yes, calm down, calm down a little bit. Here we are. Hello. I got Taylor. So last year I did a cute like, little pumpkin like trick-or-treat bin for her but this year I have two big items that would not fit in there so I found this little guy at Target I think it's a cute gift bag little guy um and then I just have white tissue paper for it but um if you guys remember I did got I got some super sponge um beauty blenders from uh, super sponge a few months ago and I have this purple one still because I'm still using the other one and I still have another one besides that so I thought the purple one was spooky, like Halloween colors purple, right? So I thought I'd give that to Tay because I love using them so much. I know she's going to be obsessed with it because she actually uses like foundation and stuff. And I feel like if I had used foundation too, this would be amazing. Um, and then I got her a little sweater weather hand cream. She really likes the more um, manly smells of the fall smells, like sweater weather, leaves, flannel, which I think those are all like more of like, have the like cologne-ish smell, you know what I'm saying? And then I put this Sephora charcoal mask in there for her. She loves to take baths, and so I couldn't make it in time to go to um, the Lush to get her some Halloween bath bombs. So I thought maybe she could just do this while I'll get in a bath. I might try to go tomorrow, but I'm not sure how much time I'm going to have and everything. And then I got her this leaves candle. Um, she said she liked these scents. So I got her this and that, and then the lotion and sweater weather. thought that would be good, but it actually smells so good. And then, I'm really excited about this one, but I got her her own Jack Skellington mug. Um, she loves Tim Burton. She used to be an actual, she used to go to the Art Institute of Colorado before it got shut down. She cares deeply about film and photography, and Tim Burton is just someone she really, really enjoys, um, which I can't blame her. His movies are incredible. We love all of his creepy little animations. Um, so I got her her own little cup of this, and I'm the most excited to give her this because when I got mine last year, she, like, really wanted one, and I was like, damn, if I would have known that, I would have gotten her it last year when I got mine. But I'm super excited. I think she's going to love it. I might try to go see tomorrow if I can go get her some bath bombs, but if not, I'm not worried. I really don't think she... I think she's going to be happy with all of this. I also have some eye masks. I might throw one of those in here for her, too. Um... But yeah, I thought those were just super simple little fall items. I didn't get her any decor or anything because she's moving to her own apartment, hopefully in the next few months. 
and I just feel like I wanted her to like settle in before I got her any decor stuff so maybe next year that will be I'll have a better time for that because right now she just has her bedroom to put stuff in so that's why but you guys look how short my hair is I feel so weird okay now we can show you guys what I got I'm very excited Josh is super excited about it too okay so in my last video I kind of was talking to you guys about how I was having troubles with the dimension and like height weirdness that I was experiencing on our TV stand um, the only thing thing we have left to decorate after this is our bar cart um, but I just I couldn't figure out how to add some like depth into it it was just like all super short and just like black for me um, so I'm very excited I got these candlestick guys they were literally sold out at every Target. I had to drive to one like so far away to go get it, but it was so worth it. Um, and then I got these black candlesticks to go inside of it for like this like, I don't know, like creepy, I don't know, cool vibe that I found on Pinterest. So I thought that would be literally perfect. I had to buy two, so I have an extra one, but that's okay. And then I got this guy because I wanted to do something like this and I had no idea where I was gonna find one of these. And I did not see them at any of the targets I went to, but the one that I went to to get this, Josh and I were going through the aisles and we saw this guy. So I decided to have fun with it. So Josh really wanted to do like exactly what's in this, like have a skeleton, skeleton head and then like add creepy gross stuff on it. But we already have this guy and I just like thought it was too much. So instead of that, we got this pumpkin guy. So it's just literally a plain white pumpkin with a black sparkle. So it still has like some of the white and black that we're interested in. And then this guy was just like literally in the little $3 section and I you can like bend his knees and stuff. So I think I'm going to have him like sit. Okay, we're not going to have him like hump the stem. But we're going to have him like, I'm going to like glue him on to sit on it in here. And then I'm also spray painting him gold. I don't know if I just said that or not. And then we're going to like take some of these spiders and I might spray paint some of them gold. Oh wait, there's a clear one in there. That's so cool. Um, that one's definitely going in there. But yeah, I might spray paint some of these gold and leave some of them black and just kind of have them kind of all like over the place. And I'm hoping to make it look cool. And then I might even go get some of those like battery um, powered little twinkle lights. You know how you can get those? And like wrap it in there too, just add some light or something. Um, but I think that will like kind of finish off this kind of area. Cause I'm thinking about having this guy back here with all of that, if you guys can envision this with me, I'm still gonna have to play around with everything. And this is just kind of what's in my head. But I was thinking that, so that way it has, has height here with the TV. And then these guys, because the candles are gonna go so high, will give us like that extra amount of height that we had there originally with our um, vases. So we will see, again, we still have to play with it. And then I also got some of the, literally this was like $4, all of this cobweb. And I think we're going to put as much of it around this mirror and creepy crawly as we can. And then probably on these mirrors too. And then the baths that I got from the uh, Target dollar section, we're going to kind of space them to go up this whole wall to kind of fill it in. I think it's gonna be really cool. Um, and then whatever's left of that, uh, we are going to try and make kind of like a fun little spooky thing with the bar cart. Um, we have two of these Halloween cups and then four of these guys and four wine glasses um, that I really want to try doing something cool with. But I'm just struggling envisioning it right now. And so I'm waiting for Josh to come home from dog sitting so we can kind of like figure it out. <laughs> it's going to be really fun and i'm going to get the spray paint and spray paint this gold little skeleton guy and then get working on some of the stuff and kind of put it together um and that's gonna be my friday night how exciting so let's do that literally look how much cooler it is when he's painted gold i can't get over it okay well that skeleton guy dries i can't say the word skeleton 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 it's a skeleton and I keep wanting to call them Skellingtons because Jack Skellington and really smart. Oh, now we're going to set up these guys. Oh, oh, they're so cute. So, oh my God, they're going, they're so cute. Oh, look how cute. Sven totally thinks I'm talking about him. You're cute too, bubbas. 
You hanging out with mommy tonight? Is it just mommy and baby? that there and then we're going to kind of mess with this thing. There she is. Look at that mama. Pretty cool. It's like it's like Aragog and then these will go on here. Wait, you guys can't even see. You see what I mean? Like a little spider guy. Kind of cool, right? I don't know. We gotta figure out a place for Mama Bee. Mama Bee open a club. Doing what it was she like. Okay, so it has been a little bit. I sat in the bed for a little bit on my phone and was texting Josh. He's at dinner with his parents tonight and I'm Jay Chillin. So I was supposed to go to Steamboat with my friend Savannah and then everything happened and bailed last minute. So we were unable to go, but that's okay. But I think I'm going to edit one of my vlogs and try and get up tonight. It's a really long one, so I might not be able to get it loaded until maybe tomorrow. But I need to take the trash out. I'm gonna clean up the house and stuff. Um, it's literally a mess. I have like laundry drying all over the place. Look how cute this baby is. Um, and I just, yeah, I need to pick up. But I also wanna show you guys, I added my new, um, sheets on i only i left my normal sheets white um to go with the bed and then i just got these colored pillowcases it's just the jersey ones literally they were 25 bucks for pa the pack of two so i think that looks really good and it kind of ties in a lot with this i was gonna get three throw pillows to go here as well but i don't know i just kind of liked it more simple and i might try and dress, like set up the pillows a different way so you can see more of the red with this one so i don't know i'm gonna play with it but I like my room really simple and warm, so I'm not like too hung up on how I'm decorating this. I also need to fold some laundry and stuff, so we are just going to have a quick chore night before we sit down and then edit and upload and just probably watch a scary movie or something. <laughs> I'm done cleaning. Second of all, I, let me see if I can get this going. I can wear a ponytail. Look at this. Look how cute. I can wear it and it's all cute and it's up there and it's not falling or saggy. Look how cute. I'm so happy. I literally never wear ponies because they just fall because my hair is so heavy and now it's holding and I'm so happy. Anyways, I finished cleaning. It's 7.26 and I'm thinking I'm going to take my makeup off, light some candles, ooh, turn on my patio lights and then sit down and edit and put on a movie. Let's turn on my lights. I'm excited. Oh my god, I must have stripped it to the door. Okay, I ended up putting on a beauty counter charcoal mask. This is like literally one of my favorite detox masks ever. Um, but like I told you guys earlier, I have like that those two zits here that I picked at and then one right here. So I'm just gonna let this suck out all those nasty oils in my face and then I'll probably do a stronger like night cream tonight for my moisturizer just to get some hydration in my face.
made it to La Loma. It's our date night, our annual date night. We've been doing this for 20 years, folks. Great. Look at the size comparison. Like, we're super high. Taylor's literally walking around the streets of Denver holding this. Boyfriend got it for Ashley, so I've been carrying it around. Yeah, David got us some gifts too, which is really cute. We are going to do our gifts now, and we're starting with David's, Taylor's boyfriend, because he loves us. He's so cute. So we got you these for your car, and for the party. And they're plastic, so This they don't means get he way. literally went out of his way yes. to go to some Halloween shit and get this. <laughs> like, that is so cute. Josh is the fucking worst. In the shower, and he was like, "Here for the booze." Ha ha ha! Like we're crazy. He's like, "Wow, it could be cute on her wall or something." I'll put it like, on the door. He literally said, "He's like, she can spray paint gold." Was like, he knows me so well. Oh, oh my god. god. Okay. I literally already spray painted like four things in house gold this weekend. So, but that's that's so if you don't, cute. one day I'm so excited for yours. So okay. like, we're gonna you go to go first because there's one item I already, I've already showed them. Oh. I'm very excited. Okay. Oh, so cute. That's what I'm most excited for. <laughs> I'm so excited to bring down my little I know, I was telling him about your temper obsession, honey, with him, so I love him. I love him so much. And then that's it, yeah. Ooh, love these. Nothing crazy, but. This is my favorite. Maybe, you go. Oh, I feel like you brought me way more. No, oh my god, no, I need shit. Okay, I wanted this. Okay. But John yeah. said, don't you do it. <laughs> Another glorious morning makes me sick. And then it just says from the movie Hocus Pocus. That's so cute. I'm gonna have my coffee and go like gold. It's like gold and tan. Oh. Okay, she also filled it with a ton of dead skeleton heads. <laughs> I saw this at Target. They're so I was like, you should wait for it. Why am I lining them up like I'm like starting an army or something? <laughs> But we can decorate our bar star with them. I know. When I just thought you could put them all around. Oh, hell yeah. Remember those things I was talking about? I just got two and just threw one in there. Hell yeah. I know you don't put them on the bottom and you run the Yeah. And you put it like this and it like for the bath bomb, but it's like a shower bomb. And it like releases oil. Hell yeah. Thank you. I'm probably going to need that when I start clinicals. Those gloves. I actually needed these so bad because I lost my green ones. I saw them and I was like, those are so good. And I'm not, clinicals are so early, I'm gonna like, oh my gosh, you guys, we're not done. <laughs> I'm done. Taylor really outdid me this no, year. No, I just put like stupid little. Oh, yes. And it has a little pity. That is so cute. I don't know how and it smells. I can but... put it in the bathroom because it matches like my orange towels I have in there. Oh, yeah. I don't know how it smells. I got that like the first time we were talking about it. So. Oh my god, it smells like the pumpkin spice or the apple cider. So that smells good. Oh man. Well, that smells great because I don't know. I love Not that. Sure. <laughs> oh, it's hot. Okay, so this one says Fresh and Witch Face. They have yeah. a lot of that. Yeah. And then that one says Witch Butter Have My Candy. I love that. I didn't see they had socks there. Yeah. They had them like right there. I was gonna get used up, but then I was like, I don't think that's the word ones I got last week. So then I gave you a pack of socks last year. Yeah, I still remember. Yes, I wanted this so bad, and I was gonna buy it, but I was like, oh wait, Tina said she needed things to get. And I was like, oh guys, it's a Beetlejuice cup. I showed him the car today, and he goes, that reminds me of Beetlejuice. And I was like, it's a Beetlejuice cup. Oh, I'm so excited. Like, oh, that makes sense. If you don't think I'm gonna end my Sunday. Hello, everybody. It is Sunday. Um, it is currently 2.40 right now. I'm starting really late on the vlog today because I got really sick last night and it was super unfortunate. This is my second time getting sick after eating at that restaurant, so I think maybe I just like my stomach. I already have underlying stomach issues. No one else I know that has had that place has had a bad experience. It's just been me so far. Um, so I have, I just, I know it's probably because my, my like already underlying stomach problems. So not going there probably ever again. Um, but I did come home and I blew chunks. So that's lovely. We all love just, you know, throwing up 
Um, I think that's why I'm so nasally right now too is because I literally it like all came out my nose too And it's just been so gross. Yeah, but I slept in I had literally the worst night's sleep of my life And when I did fall asleep, I had the worst dream. So I was just like why? And then Josh should be home this evening. I really hope he comes home soon I just have had such a bad like last I don't know 15 hours and I just want him to be with me now um but yes i i think i showed you guys a good amount of everything that taylor got me yesterday it was all super cute stuff and i'm very grateful and i think a lot of the stuff she got me i'm going to spray paint gold no surprise and use it as some fun decor stuff and then i think it also kind of helped me finish off what i needed for my bar cart i'm going to do that in a video in itself because i just know it's going to be like a 10 minute video probably um like our christmas one was but I'm really excited and I'm excited to spray paint some of the things that she had. I also really want to finish the little thing that I started the other night that I showed you guys. Like the pumpkin in the jar looking thing. Um, I have the skeleton and the sparkly spider in there now. So I just got to figure out what I want to do with it. Um, I also kind of want to wait for Josh to come home. So that he can help me and we can like throw all our, idea our ideas together. And then we also are going to tape the bats up on our wall right here. Um, like I discussed in the last vlog that we were decorating in. And then we want to put the cobweb and stuff up. And I think we might try and decorate Ernie. Again, it's already three. I don't know how much more we're going to get done today. But we'll see. Spending spots. Oh. <laughs> I saw Ollie. I'm very sorry. But yeah, just wanted to update you guys. It's been a rough morning. But yeah, I don't know what I'm gonna do. I might finish editing this video and then wait for Josh to come home. He should be home soon. He just said he's going to Costco and then coming home, so I should give him like an hour. <sighs> I'm so happy to have him home. Anyways, love you guys. <laughs> I'm gonna finish this video and probably put on, I really wanna watch Twitches and I keep not putting it on. So we're gonna put it on and it's gonna be awesome and I'm very excited. <laughs> bat wall which i'm super psyched about we're trying we tried making it i think you can kind of see how it goes let me put some spiders on there and then i think on the top part i'm gonna print out this cutout and like hang where it says like boo or something because that's on the camera and then i ended up doing like a full like spider theme in this um i might have gone a little overboard with the spiders um but i made it look like this guy like you know he's just like He's just sitting there on his pumpkin, just thinking away. I might add some twinkly lights in there, but I'm not totally sure. I think it would be cool to have it like light up for the party, but we'll see. Um, and then I have this stuff here. But the more I look at it, I'm like, now we have two gold pumpkins right next to each other. So I'm trying to figure out if there's anything I could switch over. That way, and then maybe move the pumpkin over here. But still have some of the stuff over here. Like... I'm probably gonna be playing with this until it's time to take things down Okay, nothing is set in stone yet But I just cannot get over how freaking cool This looks right now With everything lit up. Let me see if I can turn the darkness down and like like I must say it's looking pretty cool I might even like spread these around this guy and then have these kind of like on the side, but who knows. It's not gluten or dairy free, but it's the only thing that I literally can get myself to eat today. It's literally my third bowl of soup. Hopefully that's not horrible for you, but I made that and then I made some little crouton cracker guys because we don't have any. Then I did a side of soft bread just cause, and then I got Josh some. His is actually cheddar 
broccoli and cheese which is way too hard on my tummy but i'm usually good at the potato soup um but yeah these are just some costco brand ones that josh gets us i just thought it'd be a nice little cozy dinner to end a cold cozy day because it's freezing out right now all right so we wrapped up dinner and now we are about to watch beetlejuice it's 8 30 um, we'll probably go to bed right after, but I am making some tea and I'm going to drink out of my new Beetlejuice mug that Tay got me. I'm so excited. It's going to be so yummy. But I wanted to show you guys some of the products that I like to use, or not products, I guess, items that I like to use for my nighttime tea. We call it our sleepy time tea, but I've been using the Simply Gala Lavender Simple Syrup. My cousin and my auntie sent it to me from California. It is just this nightcap herbal blend, and it's so freaking good. So we're going to use that. And then I have in here, excuse, it's a giant mess in this drawer. But I have these little guys that I put it in, and then you just put it in the cup and just let it steep, and then it's really yummy. And this makes it like a really good taste all together. And I find lavender just extremely relaxing. I always put lavender diffuser in our bedroom like an hour before bed so it's like sets up the room 